welcome back this is still lifestyle which is versatile and today um we'll be preparing a very nice meal it's called seafood okra yeah seafood with okra basically the major condiments are the seafoods which are you have the shrimps you have the snails you have periwinkles you have crab you have fish so anything and everything seafood is contained in this dish so i'll be taking you on tour as we cook today um also i'll be cooking with my friend who owns cassie's kitchen yeah she is a lovely chef a lovely cook i mean it's a dish you must love so if you're within abuja you want to place an order so i'll be leaving um inscriptions on where to order if you have to and if you need to order for the food and many other foods okay so join me on the tour today and um you know i promise you it's going to be a lot of fun so do me a favor stay glued to this channel by subscribing liking this video commenting and of course share if you really loved it and look forward to having more and more other content okay so i'll see you in a bit so stay close and don't go nowhere so these are the snails got from the market and we're doing the washing process um there you go trying to wash out all the slime okay so once it's washed out once it's washed out there we rinse here we're going to rinse this now yeah so now we're having to clean it up properly so that you're sure of what you're eating this kitchen cassie's kitchen is just one sure cook <laughs> you're sure of cleanliness at least the goodness of the soul through food <laughs> it's the hot water with cold water so we've actually taken out the first water okay so we have our fish ready and washed we have the snail in the fish okay so it's ready to go into the pot to be boiled and then we'll start the process Makra is ready for grating or but we will be slicing the okra this time not actually grating okay so process of slicing the okra so the okra is ready okay so this is what you call castor castor seed known as ogiri ogiri okay our basic seafood ingredients like you have here right now you have the crab you have the periwinkle um, there you have the shrimps there is the one from the ocean and the one from the river river shrimp so have them there and then you have snails and tilapia fish you can use crocker fish if you want you can also use um, catfish it depends on the preference on your preference basically and yet yeah, of course you have your okra so there are other condiments that will come such as um, a bit of palm oil if you have salt you have your stock cubes um, you have water of course onions to season the uh, the proteins and then you also have um, pepper yeah and a bit of crayfish and all of that so it's all going to come together so just enjoy the view I'm so excited about this so see you in the kitchen snail in the pots to be boiled now stock cubes going in the pot in a bit snail stock cube yeah salt is not your thing actually a pinch now it's never before some salts and some water going on the pressure pots yeah. Our snail is ready. You can see? So, the heat is turned off now. So, we'll begin to preboil the other um, seafoods. I put hot water on it just to thicken it so it doesn't scatter so much in the pot. I'm not supposed to put it in a bowl. Pour the water over it so catch a bit. Yeah, over it, over it so. We have plenty of crayfish. It goes in two. The airports. So the 
the fish is in here along with the snail and the other seasoning like the pepper the yellow pepper the ogiri okwe also um salts yes okay and then the stock cube is also in here and the fish is going to simmer for 10 minutes and then we'll take the fish out the reason for this is so could you tell us okay so the fish doesn't scatter we all know that fishes are so quick to scatter so yeah oops So we have fish out of water, out of the boiling water. So here you go. Steamy, steamy, steamy. Yum, yum, yummy. Palm oil goes in next. Yeah. Yum, yum, yum. Oh dear lord, I am salivate. Hey, hey, hey. How long is the um stuff going to boil for? Ten minutes. Ten minutes? I was like fish too. Okay. Mmm, yeah, yeah. The crab is already pinkish and whitish. Done in, done in. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's true. That part was a different color. Wow. There goes the parry. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So colorful. Mmm. Nutritious. Ah, it tastes of goodness, right? This is Cass's kitchen steel. Stir again. So there goes the crawfish. This is the finished work. Yes. Mm, so yummy, like so so yummy. Cass's kitchen does you right. So head on oh, here no. and get ready to order. Like start placing your orders right about now. Who's ready? You can eat this with eba, pounded yam, apple, and any kind of swallow. And you can just eat it like this. Mm -hmm. is that oh, whatever you want to use. All right. Thank you for your time. Love you loads. Bye.